Hello. How are y'all doing today? Hopefully well. It's about like nine in the morning. I'm gonna use these old cards to see what pulls out if it's any kind of different energy. Okay, let's see what pulled out. Uh, it says, just look to the stars and heavens and God sees all. Okay, so don't forget, just look to the stars and heaven and God sees all. And would you love to come and build our lives together? Somebody wants to build a life with you all out there. See that? Ooh. And you get a lot of downloads by the water. So you need to go sit by the water and you'll get your spiritual downloads. Or go put your feet in the water. It says, hey, I know who the ring leader is of the bunch. So you must know who the ring leader is of whatever situation you're in. Is divine masculine is feeling down and out wishing he could get closer to divine feminine divine feminine is doing her own thing so you're all doing your own things out there divine feminine divine masculine is wanting to know how he can come back around you <laughs> he wants to build a life together with you and it seems like i've lost everyone in my life that i confided in so maybe you're all feeling just alone Everybody you told something to don't want to have nothing to do with you. And that's all right. That's all right. Just push through it. It'll be okay. And uh, it says, I'm happy energy, not toxic energy. That's good. Yeah, because you look to stars in heaven, you know. And you're excited and blessed. You got a soulmate. It, you got butterflies in your stomach because it's a divine union. A divine union's coming close. Who? <laughs> And it says your past over brother is fighting for you right now. He's seen all the lies and deceit coming from people. So your dead brother is fighting for you right now. And it could be because he's seen that somebody's children ain't coming around him anymore because of what the karmics told them. The kids was all lies. Karmics meaning business associates, people in your family grandmother grandfathers you know cousins frenemies frenemies but you're you're seeing who the ring leader is evidently now and and that's good <coughs> hang on i'm trying to figure out something okay so i'm gonna use these cards I'm gonna use these cards you all I wrote on them. It's these, uh, this Egyptian tarot. I'm trying to remember the name of it. Eternal tarot, I believe is what it said. But, uh, they got a lot of different meanings and they got letters on them. So if I see something spelled out, I'll let you know, okay? Spirit, can we have a message today for the people viewing? A message for the people viewing. Message for all signs, Spirit. This is going to be a message for all signs, okay? Message for all signs, Spirit. 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 Okay. Rokey dokey. So we got number 28, uncertainty. 
and this is linked to the letter to the number one and to the letter Z and it says do not seek in others for what is in the for what's inside yourself you can't go seek it in another person nor seek in thee for what is in others if you feel like somebody else is better than you yeah you can't don't go seeking that out from somebody else it says there's delays going on in obstacles that you've had to cross um contrities mysteries to be solved and science to solve them so you're feeling uncertain about going towards this person that you're attracted to you will have sex with because it says twilight and that means sex number 18 this is about instability inconstancy ambush in confusion changes uncertain situations long deliberations tardy results apparent triumphs and failings so you're you're in uncertain mode because you don't know if you should go towards this person or not because because they're in stable that's what it is and triumph number seven a struggle a battle more difficulties magnetic power union of intellect intuition justice and reparations honor and dishonor yeah there's gonna be honor and dishonor if you go towards this person that you're feeling uncertain towards achievement of that which is desired pursued with determination satisfaction and disappointment so you've been pursuing this person like as a desire but you're you're uncertain about them well probably because they haven't talked to you or something it's just a struggle between you all and i would want to go towards somebody that wants to have something to do with you you know what i mean so maybe this is like a psychopath <laughs> wanting to go towards somebody and never saying nothing and then they end up killing your ass that's what psychopaths do okay so let's don't go them paths all right love and desire you're just you're in love with somebody and you're desiring them but maybe they already have a relationship and that's why you're uncertain because they're in a relationship promises illusion ardent passions attractions ambitions hope in something that depends on the will of the opposite sex hope in something that depends on the will of the opposite sex delights unexpected goods danger of losing them because interference of false friends so so uh your friends these false friends is getting ready to rush towards you during the moonlight see twilight twilight so yeah you know, it you was feeling uncertain again and wonder why because it was the full moon i told you they do magic on the moon you all at these cycles every fucking moon cycle they do it especially these full moons and you gain your power in the full moon because you know how to return all that shit back i do i return it every full moon don't worry you all you're not gonna get to me people that's trying to get to me you're not gonna get to me or to my collective people because i know how to return back for us Somebody's got uh, vehemence, zeal. Somebody's got an extreme passion towards you. But they got a fetching temper. Look at this man, like he grabbing this guy by the heart of the head and going to whoop him with something. See that? Wow. And that's letter A. So what letters what we got? A, P, Z. And then we got Scorpio and who is that one? Pisces. This is about 
So there's somebody that's wanting to, you're in an enterprise and, it, and you're going to be fighting in this enterprise because of vigor. Uh, but you're going to have success and love but somebody has animosity. To, somebody has animosity towards your love life. They they don't like you because they tried these false fake friends has tried many times to separate you, you and your love, and they can't. They can't. And they've done this to me and my husband for many many years. People's tried to break us up because they know we're special. You know what I mean? People's told us we're special, and we look good at, with each other. Yeah, because they know. Because they know that we're, that we're from God. That's why. You can't break us. You can't break a twin flame. So don't even try. You're not going to fucking succeed. You'll fucking die. God will kill you for trying to break us up. I'm telling you right now. I'm telling you right now. I'm trying to help people with this twin flame stuff. Because I've lived it for 23 years. Nobody's going to tell me I'm wrong. There's a lot of these readers like, You're going to get karma if you don't leave that karmic. Nah. I'm not with a karmic. I'm with my twin flame. And I know, motherfuckers, you ain't going to tell me any difference. So everybody's got their own opinion. Everybody's got their own eyes. Oh, that's well. <laughs> Ain't that how y'all look at it? Yeah, so... Let's see what pulls out with this uncertainty. No, I'm gonna get... Let's see what pulls out with this uncertainty. So it could be like somebody you looked up to as like a dad. All I got was Pa, P-A out of them letters up here. So maybe it's somebody like that that you're that you thought of as a father figure and they're trying to come up against you because you wouldn't have nothing to do with them but you didn't want nothing to do with them sexually because you probably already had a relationship oh what about uncertainty oh hiding they're hi they're hiding their emotions hiding this connection do not seek in others for what is in the nor seeking the for what is in others. Delays, obstacles, contrities, mysteries to be resolved and science to solve them. So people, this person that feels uncertain sees you as a mystery. That's what it is. Uh, clarify, clarify uncertainty, clarify uncertainty. Oh, to ease a crowd. That's what it is. Pain and suffering through emotional loss. End of a relationship. Heartbreak through separation. Emotional disturbances. Mental anguish. So this person that feels uncertain to come towards you, they're, they're still in pain over the a heartbreak is what it says. What about twilight sex dangers of initiation the unexpected impediments huh. instability in your family somebody's family out here somebody might put an ambush ambush confusion on you see they're doing them magic spells on the moon they're putting trying to do confusion i know i felt it and I know what I was thinking of yours, and I know that it was in magic, and I prayed to God, and God took it away. Oh, and look here. Confu they was trying to make you feel like you had an option again. I told you, I felt that. I felt that. They're trying to make you feel like you got options, and I know I don't got no options. But there's judgment to be called on this family. Don't worry. The angels is going to judge it fairly. <laughs> They're going to come get this family. That's trying to break up your family. It's a whole family trying to come after your family. And these are negative people. Poor choices. Poor choices in that family. That's what it's saying. Okay. And what else about 
Trump. Trump over all these difficulties. Spirit, what else about Trump over all these difficulties? You're going to get an offer from a page of pentacles, a young energy. Uh, maybe you're in a battle with a son and and he's stuck to this partnership. Maybe this family that's against you, he's, he's in cahoots with them. Yeah, it tells on them. See how it does? This son is stuck in doing these things over and over because they get persuaded by these other peoples. That's what it said up our persuasion. Pursued achieving of that which is desired, pursued with determination, satisfaction, and disappointment. It's either they was feeling satisfied when they had you feeling out of sorts and like you had options and now now they're disappointed. They're disappointed that they can't do this anymore to you. Ain't that something? Some of the bitches. Ain't that something? I mean, what about love and desire? Spirit. What about love and desire? What about love and desire? What about love and desire? Spirit. Here's what's about love and desire. Okay. Yeah. There's going to be messages coming towards you. Lively, energetic, passionate, independent woman that's career oriented, and you're going to be a successful, honest, thoughtful leader in the community. You're seeking positive development, and it could be you've got a love and desire for this Emperor Zeti, this Aries, Aries Leo Sag. Aries Emperor. So you're going to get messages about love and desire from this Aries Leo or Sag. But it, it promises illusion. Did you hear that? It's all an illusion. It's not real. It's fake. 17, 17, 88. It's fake. It's just about ardent passions, attractions. You know, so you're attracted to somebody, but ambitions. Hope is something that depends on the will of the opposite sex. So they're depending on you to use your willpower to come towards them. Unexpected goods. Danger of losing them because of interference of false friends. So this false friend is trying to break up your relationship. I'm telling you right now with this emperor. I'm telling you. And I'm married to my emperor, okay, you guys? Let's see what's over here. Hang on. <coughs> I got a good man. Let's see. What about this behemoth zeal? This person that's wanting to beat you, it looks like, or grab you by hair to head and yank you. Yeah, that's what they want to do. He shows and sing pulling his hair, see? He wants to whoop your eyes. And it could be this emperor wants to whoop your eyes. <laughs> This is an enterprise that requires fights, meaning there's going to be competition, competition all the time. Yep. <laughs> you're building your, you're building your wealth, whatever you're doing right now. You're building your wealth, and you moved away from this karmic, karmic lesson. This Aries Leo or Sagittarius, yeah, you moved against this karmic lesson. That's what it is. This uh, reptilian lizard man, lizard man skin. Um, that's a dick that's wanting to cross all your boundaries and break up. And they got a bad temper. They got a real bad temper. And if you don't go with what they say, they'll start rumors on you and stuff. And yeah, and I got away from people like this. I worked with in an enterprise. It wasn't an enterprise. It was a damn stockyard, and I got away from them because that's all they did. That they, they thought they could just keep on keeping on fucking with my family, and no, they can't. Okay, it doesn't say there's paying. There's paid these kids to. I mean, they would did something to keep our kids away. Did you notice? Yeah, that's true. That's true. And then I. 
And then I talked to one of the people yesterday. Yeah, it was a woman, though. It wasn't this dick, man, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, she was being nosy is what it was. See what I'm doing. I'm sitting at the house. What are you all doing? I, I tend to my own business. I don't bother nobody. Y'all, y'all was trying to ruin me in the community. I don't really care for any of you anymore. Hmm. Okay, what else? Let's see if they get that. Okay, now let me look at this. This family had lack of morals. That's why judgment got called on it. And you're going to have an opportunity. A, a little opportunity is coming towards you. And it'll it'll make you feel stable. And messages is coming towards you and your emperor. About this business you're working on. And how you moved away from this lizard king. King Lizard Sagittarius Aries or Leo. Yeah, that's what it means. Karmic. How you moved away from karmic. Karmic. Yeah, because that's what the fuck it is. Karmic. Alright, Spirit Can. Can you give us one of these messages for the people watching today? Please and thank you. Over oh, here for Under the Moon and Pain and Suffering Heartbreak. Don't compare yourself to other people. Love yourselves for who you are and choose to be a healed individual that is happy with yourself. Y'all see, they can't they can't get to you with their moon spells anymore and try to get you to go towards somebody. They can't do that anymore because they know because you're healed. Ain't it funny? And you've matured into this beautiful centered person who's blossomed into full awareness of the gifts you bring to others. Yeah, uh-huh. We did do that. We're so pretty, and we can go around with goofy hair, and we still love ourselves, and we're not going to go around cheating, if that's what y'all think. No, we're not like that. That's how you all are like lizard skin. That's not us. That's you all lizard skin. And no, I'm not talking about my children. I'm talking about older idiots in their 40s, okay, y'all? Uh, and Twilight, Sex, Danger of Initiation. Well, fuck them all. Look here. This is what Judgment said. F them all that mess with your family. We're going to take them down. See that? Yeah. Spirit's going to take them down. Spirit is. I got spirit. Uh, my spirit guides will come after them. Don't worry. They're coming towards this family that tried to mess with my family. Every time it's a full moon. I know it. I done told y'all. And you moved away from these idiots. And you're working on your business. And your business is this. Look. Uh, make your main priority in life to stand up for yourself and for your beliefs. And you are someone who loves astrology and stars. This is this is your life. This is your destiny. You're you're supposed to do this. And look, that's right. <laughs> These people do magic with candles on you and and you've noticed this by now and you notice that it come from these old people that you used to work with. Yeah. I'm not talking about people in Tarot. I'm talking about my old job. These people did magic on us, see? And now they're definitely doing it in Tarot. We know that, okay? Okay, so they're stuck on doing magic with it. With you, that's what it is. And, and uh, this uh, love and desire, you feel like danger losing your love and desire don't because you and you and emperor is having a come up in that community don't worry what else for emperor they're trying to break in and steal from your older kids now and the law has their eyes on these damn crooks Ooh, see that told you see they don't like your kids they lied and act like they do and they're trying to steal from them and what else? Somebody's saying, who the fuck are you to try and tell me how to live my life? I choose to live in the loud energy. Yeah, that's what we're telling you. You can't break up my love and desire I have for my 
for my emperor. You can't, my emperor, I love him. I, I live with him. And we're choosing to work on ourselves. And these, this person just wanted to beat us about. We moved away from that people. Oh, yeah, because we're highly protected by the divine and you are. They can't get to us. See that? We got these beings that have six wings and eyeballs all over. They can't, they can't get past that. It's going to come latch on them and kill them. It'll kill them in their job. Don't worry, it'll kill them. And uh, you feel like a giddy schoolgirl when you get around this person that you love. You're like, tee hee, tee hee, tee hee. I hope y'all get your love out there. I got mine, yeah. Tee hee, tee hee. <coughs> and you need to connect to your higher selves and do what is right for you and the good of all involved. And that's what we did. Tee hee, ain't it funny? Tee hee, spirit said. Tee hee, you do, the, you do for the good of all. You'll sacrifice yourself for the good of all. Yeah, 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 I will, yeah. Yeah. Okay, and you're beautiful, and you're beautiful. Oh, and look here. And this person that's trying to break you all up, it said, this man may want to give you an STD because they thought you are a damn prostitute. But look at these nuts. They got these nuts. Has these red shit all over it. No. Why would you want that? Ew. And this person is in love with you. They're wishing that you'll give them a chance to show and prove to you that they are the person of your dreams. Uh, this is for somebody that you all don't want. But they really are wanting you. <laughs> and they're doing all this damn magic under the moons. And you're like, fuck these people. And the angels is like, don't worry. They're coming to get this family. Family of crooks. Family of crooks. Because these people sits around high on Xanaxes all day. And spirit don't like them. And uh, you're climbing the ladder to success, baby. Divine masculine is. Look here. They went around saying that you all was high all the time on medicine. And we're like, well, fuck you all. That's a damn lie. And uh, these people you used to work with are doing magic on you because you're in astrology. And they're like, baby. Will you please come back here and let us put another one over you on you at this job? And you're like, fuck no, uh uh, no. And they want to break in a steal from your kids because you live in the light energy. Yeah, because you, because they don't know what real love feels like. It feels light, fun, abundant, caring, and giving. And these people uh, wants to break your relationship up because they've never felt that or had it. They're into lying, cheating, doing whatever. One, if one says something, then the other runs and does something stupid and they thought you was going to continue doing that. Maybe you did do that for but you, did, you didn't keep on doing it and spirit loves you. <laughs> and it says, let go of the old you and embrace the new you shining through. Look here. You're a new peacock shining through. See your bright blue feathers? Yeah, and I know it kind of looks goofy, but I was trying to make one. <laughs> oh, and the angels love you. You're protected by the divine, and they're like, tee hee, you're in your higher self. Well, we love you. And we know they went around and lied on your name and told all kinds of bullshit on your name that wasn't true. Tee hee, we're going to get them. The angels said, tee hee, we're going to kill them. <laughs> tee hee, we're going to kill them. We're going to kill them for you. Because you're a beautiful person that loves to help all kinds of people, and we're going to get them for you. And you need to clean and clear your energy and sweep it out your house right now. Don't worry, I know how to do that right here in just a minute after this reading. And Divine Masculine is very action-oriented, and we're not on dope. And we said, fuck all the people that said that, that, that we was. Uh, and we we see each other even in the astral realm. What's how much we love each other? We see each other in the physical every day and in the astral. Oh wow! And this is the this realm is vibrational energy, the place behind the world and material existence. The soul goes here after death of body, and you all have climbed all the way up to the astral plane. Oh, ain't it good? Yeah, hit a little like, hit a little subscribe. I need to help. And if you're a person that does astrology and stars, uh, star work like me, people's doing magic on you, and you know that, and they're, they're like, come here, let me get one over on you again, and you're like, fuck you. 
Yeah, because because they know that you're going through an ascension process and you're moving up a level in the spiritual realm and and uh, divine order got called and this is when you put in the plan of the divine and if people think they can stop the plan, no they can't so don't worry about it honey. They, they think, they wish that you would come back to them but they know that you're not going to and you know what real love is. You helped to heal many people and they chose to spread lies on you. Said you're an addict, but actually they are the true druggie. And you kept saying to them to stop doing cocaine and drugs. Oh, wow, maybe you're like me and you know somebody that did a lot of coke at your old job and you was like, quit doing that shit. Quit doing it around your kids. Quit. Oh, wow. Ain't that something. <laughs> and we're highly protected. Tee hee. Tee hee. Yeah, and your angels will surround you and lead you away from people who will harm you. So remember to be grateful. Don't feel sad about not being around that one person because the angels led you away from them. The angels did. So be glad of that. And angels come out twice. And it could be it's Taurus that the angels led you away from. And because you didn't start focusing all your attention on, and, mo and money on them. That's what it was. You you was a uh, you was you start focusing on true love, and this person wants to drown you. So please don't go swimming with this dude because he wants you dead. See, the angels steered you away from his tours because they wanted to drown you. Did you hear that? And uh, somebody is on their way to the hospital because of one of their organs is starting to shut down from all the drug use in the past, drug use and drinking. There you go, Taurus. There you go, Taurus. That's what's having a Taurus, I hate to say it. All right, well. Let me get you a little love message, a love message, and that's all I'm doing. Love message. One love message, Spirit. Passion. I like you. Not today. Hammer. Okay, passion. You got an insane chemistry and you like each other equally and you're having fun. Ooh. And they say, I like you, I like you a lot. And someone likes you. Romance is blooming, fun flirting, and they want to date you. Oh, wow. And somebody over here ain't dealing with the hurt. They're avoiding a conversation, a call, or avoiding this person because you set your boundaries and you're still angry. And Hammer said, somebody's trying to sabotage what you've been rebuilding. They're wanting to interrogate you and to be receptive to them. And they're persistently working on it. No, don't mess with them people. And two more love messages, 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 two more love messages. Oh, here's two more love messages. Your soulmate loves you. Soul connection, partnership, agreement, soul contract, camera. Reminisking, keepsake. They're reminisking over your pictures at the moment. Ooh, you changed your perception and You've learned from the past, and you're making new memories with your soulmate. Oh, yes, I'm married to my soulmate, and I love you, soulmate. I love you, soulmate, and I'm sorry for doing the things I did. But God's going to get these people, and you're all going to be talking to your soulmate. Oh, you're going to be talking to your soulmate soon. They're they're interested in having a conversation with you. They're awaiting a messaging, a, a waited message arrives, a text, call, or email. So you're getting ready to get a text or call or email from this person. So good for you all. And I love y'all. And I hope this helps. And if you're new and you watch it all the way through, would you please hit subscribe? I need the help. And I appreciate you very much. And I love you. And 3434-77, I love you. Peace. <laughs>